Okay guys, so check this out. Snoop Dogg has issued a public apology to veteran journalist Gail King for lashing out at her following a controversial interview with WNBA legend Lisa Leslie. During the conversation, King asked Leslie about Kobe Bryant's 2003 sexual assault case, which Snoop and many others consider disrespectful. In an Instagram video posted on Wednesday, February 12th, the D-O-double-G revealed he had a talk with his mother who inspired him to issue a heartfelt amends to King. Coming at you live and direct with a message. Two wrongs don't make no right. When you're wrong, you gotta fix it. So with that being said, Gail King, I publicly tore you down by coming at you in a derogatory manner based off of emotions me being angry at questions that you asked, um, overreacted. I should have handled it way different than that. Uh, I was raised way better than that. So I would like to apologize to you publicly for the language that I used and calling you out of your name and just being disrespectful. I didn't mean for it to be like that. I was just expressing myself for a friend that wasn't here to defend himself. Um, a lot of people look up to me and they love me and they appreciate me, so I want to let them know that. Anytime you mess up, it's okay to fix it. It's okay to man up and say that you're wrong. I apologize. Hopefully we can sit down and talk privately. Have a good day. He added in the caption, had a talk with my mama. Thank you, mama. Two wrongs don't make it right. Time to heal. At Gail King, peace and love. Praying for you and your family, as well as Vanessa and the kids. Last week, Snoop delivered a proper you to both King and Oprah Winfrey while simultaneously calling for Bill Cosby's freedom. Consequently, former U.S. National Security Advisor Susan Rice told Snoop to back the f off of King. While sports journalist Jamel Hill was forced to remind the West Coast thanks to rap OG, Cosby was a convicted sexual predator. The clip of King's interview with Leslie, which she insisted was taken out of context, resulted in death threats aimed at the seasoned journalist. In a follow-up Instagram video, Snoop denied ever threatening King, stating he's a non-violent person. So, what do you guys think? Did Snoop Dogg really have to apologize, or did he just give in because of public pressure? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to HipHopDX.com.